Hey guys, this is Tiamat Ruler back with another episode of Random Wonder Trades. And we will get right into this and start wonder trading off Beldums. If you have watched my streams, which I still need to get on YouTube, unfortunately, I'm just haven't gotten around to that yet. Uh, but if you've watched my streams, I have not gotten a shiny Beldum yet. I'm going to try to keep breeding to those streams now so that you can see me get it. But um, I had. I, the last stream I did was like six hours and 150 eggs, and I still didn't get it. So, um, and there goes my phone, which is too far away for me to f go get right now since I'm already recording. So, we're gonna have to deal with that um, as we get Zarino from Germany, North Rhine, Westphalia. Um, gonna get us something good to start us off. That'd be cool, a shiny or something, something good. A mill tank, not bad. Mill tank's not bad at all. Mill tank can be really good. Um, mill tank can be really bad too, but if it's got like milk drink and uh, I think I can get fake out and things like that, and that'll be cool. Body slam. Body slam's pretty good. Stab, chance for paralysis. Um, but we're going to check that out once we get through all six Pokemon like normal. And... Uh, also, as always, um, if you want to be a part of one of my Wonder Cut battles, which these Wonder Trade videos, Random Wonder Trade videos are connected to, then just leave in either the Random Wonder Trades videos or the Wonder Cup battles videos, just leave your, in the comments, leave your um, friend code, your in-game name, and some way to contact you, like Twitter. Um, and we get Steven from Indiana, and who said, Peeps is here. Not sure what that means, but uh, um, as far as the way to contact you, Twitter is preferred because Twitter is super easy to contact people with. Um, obviously, if you don't have a Twitter, that I mean makes sense. If you don't have a Twitter, that you you won't be able to con give me a Twitter. But uh, whatever easy way to contact you, where, where you will be able to respond like as soon as possible, pretty much. Um, where I'll know if you don't respond within like 10 minutes to half an hour that you're not available to participate, if that makes sense. And Spinarak is pretty cool. Um, we haven't actually, I don't think I've ever actually gotten a Spinarak from Random Wonder Trades. I've gotten Ariados, but I don't think I've ever gotten a Spinarak. Granted, Ariados would probably be better, but not necessarily. Spinarak could have egg move since you have to breed it to get it. Ariados, um... It's probably just right off would probably just be right off the route so that's pretty cool um as we get dylan i didn't see where you were from i'm sorry about that and we get a snubble not bad fairy type um could have like the fang moves on it could be pretty cool it's a fairy type and has ice fang that'd be really cool um yeah i think that you can breed the fang moves onto it i'm not sure I guess we'll find out what it is. It's probably just right off the route, though. But still. I'm going to trade the fourth one here and hope for something good as well. Obviously, we're always hoping for something good, something super nice. Last week, I, I always like wonder trade all, all the Beldums I have throughout the whole Wednesday. And last week, I got two Shinies. Last week... I ended up getting a, uh, I think it was last week that I got two shinies. I'm pretty sure it was, where I got a Larvitar, and I ended up getting a freaking uh, Love Disc, which was ridiculous, but, and we get a Magikarp, which is probably, I didn't even see who that was, I'm sorry, I was talking, but uh, Magikarp, we're probably going to end up wonder trading off unless we get something worse as our wild card. Uh, make sure to remember the rules. Uh, if you're going to try, if you want to participate, make sure to remember the rules. Um... Wonder trade just six Pokemon for a team, and then at the end, and if you get like duplicates, you can wonder trade them off. But it has to be the the duplicate that you get. You have to keep the first one that you get. You can't wonder trade off the first. You can't pick and choose which ones you get if you get duplicates, or which ones you keep. So I mean, you don't have to wonder trade off duplicates if you really want to use. Um, like two fletchlings or something because they're both good then you can but um 
usually people don't want to use duplicates and it's michael from ontario canada saying it's mikey time okay um but yeah duplicates you can trade off has to be the second one you get um can't be the first one you have to keep the first one and we get a sand dial not bad um but also at the end after you wonder trade all six pokemon and all your any duplicates you get you can do then do one wild card at the end which it's a wild card clause it's pretty much Razbowski came up with the that clause for this for wonder cup battles and uh, i really like that clause because pretty much it means that at the end you can look at all your pokemon and you can pick one pokemon at the end whether it's like the worst pokemon in in your party or it's like one, a, po a pokemon that you get all the time in wonder cup battles um then you can pick it and you can trade it off but you have to keep whatever you get whether it's a duplicate or it's a you have to keep whatever you get whether it's a duplicate or it's a uh really crappy pokemon like a ralts with growl or an abra with teleport you have to keep it you can't wonder trade it off again just because you don't like it um so that's how the wild card rule works just to make sure you get you guys know that's how the wild card rule works and you get it we get a tyrant i'm not going to complain about a tyrant you can have those fang moves on it as well big jaw fang and the fangs i think it's big jaw whatever it's it is i think that's what it's called though big jaw or whatever and then uh all the fang moves yeah that would be awesome but uh, we are going to go back into the Wonder Trade system, and then we, we've traded off all six of our Pokemon, so we got, are going to go take a peek at what we have. First off is the Mill Tank. It looks like it's right off the route, but it does have a Moo Moo Milk on it. I don't know if Moo Moo Milk can be... I don't know. I'll have to ch take a look at Moo Moo Milk. Um, milk drink, bide, rollout, and body slam. So that's not bad. So it does have milk drink and it does have body slam. So, but it does look like it was right off the route. But still, that's not bad. Scrappy can hit ghost types. So that's cool. Uh, we have the Spinarak. It's a level one with poison sting, string shot, night slash, and mega horn. Holy crap. That's definitely better than any area dose I would end up getting. Um, and then Snubble, right off the route with Headbutt, Lick, Bite, and Charm. Uh, Bite's still pretty cool. It's got that Intimidate, so... Whoops. And then uh, we've got the Magikarp with Splash. It's probably going to be our one or our wild card. Um, we've got a level 17 Sandile with Sand Attack, Torment, Sand Tomb, and Assurance. Looks like that's right off the route as well. Um, but it does have a couple of Stab moves, so that's cool. And then we've got, oh my god, the Adamant Strong Jaw Tyrant with Fire Fang, Dragon Dance, Thunder Fang, and Ice Fang. Holy shit, man. That one right there is probably going to be our MVP. Um, I could be completely wrong, and it ends up not being our MVP, but that one's probably going to be our MVP. I'm excited about that one. I always like getting like the Pokemon that have all the Fang moves on them. Plus it has Dragon Dance. That's just cool. Um, but we are going to go ahead and want wonder trade off this magikarp here is our wild card and see what we get as i'm gonna look at the message i got on skype okay it's someone telling me about twitter updating their web page um i'm not gonna do anything with that yet um just so I can continue recording, so I don't interrupt the recording with any <laughs> stupid stuff. But, uh, let's see what we get here. We get a Letty Butt. Probably better than the Magikarp. Probably better than the Magikarp. Not excited about the Letty Butt, but it's probably better than the Magikarp, at least. I mean, at least there's that about it. So, um, we will have to go take a look at it real quick just to see what it is let's go into our box so we don't actually accidentally wonder trade again um it's got tackle it's a level one with tackle someone bred it up and it's a level one with tackle but it's better than the magic because it's got an attacking move so <laughs> but i'm gonna have to say that either 
this Tyrant or this Spinarak will become our MVPs because Megahorn is nice. Um, nice and powerful stab move. I mean, that's like a hundred and some... Yeah, that's like 120. I mean, sure, it's got 85%, but it's 120 damn or 120 power, which really is 180 power. So, with the stab, which is awesome. That's nice. And then it's got Knight Slash 2, which is cool. Critical hits land more easily. Not bad at all. Um, but yeah, that's our team. Make sure to leave the information I need in the comment section if you want to uh, participate in a Wonder Cup battle. But, um... Yeah, I'll look. Uh, the Wonder Cup battle should be up on Friday or Monday, depending on what I what happens. Um, it's been on Monday the last couple times, but uh, usually I try to get it up on Friday. Just depends on what I have on my what I'm doing and if I end up having time on Friday in the end to because that Wonder Cup battles take a lot to uh, a lot to uh, edit. So, but. I'll try to get it on Friday, but it'll be up on Monday otherwise, if it's not up on Friday. But, yeah, um, if you like the video, leave a like. If you're a first-time viewer, please subscribe. And this is Tiamat Ruler signing out, and I will see you guys next time. Thanks for watching, and have a great day. Peace!